All right, everyone. Please open your book on page 150. Wow, it's a big picture of the dinosaurs. Yes, it is. Who can name me some of the dinosaurs in the picture? Me, please. Yes, Amy. The one that was flying in the sky was a pterosaurus. On the ground, I can see three diplodocuses. Their necks were extremely long. And behind the rocks were a Tyrannosaurus rex. Well done, you know a lot of dinosaurs' names. I know some too, Mrs. Michelle. Can I say it? Sure, go ahead. The one that was eating crabs in the top right corner of the pictures were a Triceratops. And behind the mountain, I can see the shadow of some Stegosaurus. Excellent. It seems like you both have the same interest in studying dinosaurs, don't you? Yes, yes we, we do. do. Okay. Please read me some question at the bottom of the page. This will be your homework today. The first question is, what were dinosaurs like? Next is, when and how did dinosaurs become extinct? Do you think there are any dinosaurs alive today? Okay, thanks. Robert, read me the rest, please. Do you think dinosaur was smart? What do you think dinosaur did in their free time? Why are so many people interested in dinosaurs? Perfect. Based on this question, you will make a small presentation on Google Slides to show what you know about dinosaur. Is it clear? When do we need to present our work in the class, Ms. Michelle? The due date is next Thursday. Wonderful. I will ask my dad to take me to the Dinosaur Museum in town. Now it's time to say goodbye. I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye, boys and girls. Goodbye, Goodbye Miss, Miss, Miss Michelle. Michelle. See you, see soon. you soon. Hey, Robert. Who will pick you up? Nobody. I go home on my foot. How about you? So do I. Let's walk together. We can talk about dinosaurs. Great. Can you hand me a book off the table? There's some important information that we need to look through for the project. Oh, I have the same book at home. Did you read it all? Of course I did. I read it twice. And I'm about to read it again tonight for the third time. Wow, incredible. Okay, tell me about your favorite dinosaur, please. Which one do you like the most? Mm, I like Ankylosaurus. It is an armored dinosaur. It's for about 33 feet long. Yeah. The Ankylosaurus lived more than 66 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. I used to like it too, but now I changed my mind. Why? Because they are herbivores. They only ate small shrubs and ferns. They seem weak to me. I prefer something bigger and eat meat. In fact, they were not weak at all. Some scientists believe the Ankylosaurus could break its predator bones with its powerful tail club. Really? Oh, that's right. The Ankylosaurus could swing its club tail when in danger. You said you like a giant dinosaur? I guess your favorite one is the T-Rex, am I right? Bingo! I love them. My uncle Jim is a paleontologist. He gave me a big model of T-Rex last week. Do you want to come over to have a look? Yeah, I'd love to. 
Your uncle is so awesome. It might be very gorgeous. It's cost my uncle more than two thousand dollars. Really? That means I could not ask my dad to buy one for me. We could not afford something fancy like that for sure. Never mind. You can buy yourself one when you grown up. Yep. I hope I still like dinosaur until that. Tell me more about T Rex, please. I'm keen on them. Well, T Rex lived in this earth for seventy million years ago. They have short teeth and claws. I have to admit, they were a huge dinosaur. A T Rex could weigh up to fourteen thousand pounds. A strong net held up its giant head. How tall was it? Its head reached up to five feet long. Wow, what an animal creatures! That's why it's worth a perfect predator. It uses size and strength to take down prey. Yeah, and it's also a scavenger. It ate any food it could find, such as rotten meat, triceratops, and Admonstrosaurus. Oh, you know what I feel funny about T Rex? No, what is it? That teeth were about the size of a banana. Yep, but they were very strong. A T Rex could crush bone with one bite only. Huh? Really? Unbelievable! That's insane. One more interesting thing about them is that they could eat up to two hundred and thirty kilograms of meat in one bite. They ate a lot. Fantastic. Unfortunately, a huge asteroid hit the Earth about sixty-six million of years ago, and the dinosaur became extinct. Yeah, remember Miss Michelle questions. See, as do you think if there is any dinosaur still alive nowadays? I believe some of them were saved from extinction, and we call them birds. Are birds the living dinosaur? Hmm, maybe. How about you? What do you think? In my opinion, there's still no evidence to prove that they are still alive, so I think no. Oh, Amy, I know of a very funny game that lets you check what dinosaur you are. What do you mean? Well, it's kind of a personality quiz. Ah,、uh, you have to answer some question. Now, tell me, what food do you like the most? Fish sticks, cheese pizza, or chicken nuggets? I'll pick chicken nuggets. What superpower would you like to have? Breathing under the water, ah,、uh, super sight, or super speed? Hmm, breathing under the water. How do you refer to spend your time? Hanging out with friends. Which of these is your favorite animals? An eagle, shark, or rhinoceros? Eagle. What color do you like the most? Red, gray,、uh, green, purple, brown, or blue? Red, please. Now choose a、uh, mythical creatures. Big food, a dragon, the long nest monster, or a mermaid. Mermaid, mermaid, mermaids are my favorite creatures. What is your ideal vacation spot? Ah,、uh, Canada, Egypt, Montana, or China. Canada. I visited Canada once. Okay, this is the last question for you. How would your friend describe you? Mm, I think my friends think of me as a friendly, loud, and energetic person. This is the resort. You are the Velociraptor. What really? What did it say? You're a natural group leader and aren't afraid to say what you think, but you also know when to keep quiet. Just like Velociraptor did before it pounced on its assuming prey, you may enjoy flashy fashion, 
this dinosaur wore feathers. But you always remember to stay grounded. Oh my goodness, that's so true. Here's my house. Let's come inside to check out my T Rex model. Okay, do you have a phone? Could I call my mom to tell her in advance? Sure. <laughs> 